Welcome vlog to day two of the four pass loop here in Aspen. We woke up at about 6.15, 6.20. As you can tell, we've already taken down the tent and Alec is just starting to work on getting some water boiled for some oatmeal for breakfast. I, of course, will be starting my day with an old trusty cliff bar as I always do, the best one, mint chocolate. Whenever Cliff's ready to sponsor me, this video will be out for him. <laughs> but anyways, today we're going to be hiking to Snowmass Lake, which should be about eight miles, a couple thousand feet of elevation, so nothing crazy. But after a day one, we're pretty tired, so we'll see how it goes. But we'll start updating you along the way. So we just came down from our campsite, which was up there. And we're going to start our day by filling up on water, see what we have after the hike. to our first water crossing. Um, it's right here. Then you want to do the honors? Cross? You go first. Me first? Yeah. You go first. You do the honors. All right, let's do this. I'm going to take it on the shallow into the left right here. Woo! <laughs> that is cold. <laughs> Dylan, you coming? Yeah. Oh my god, it's so cold. Yeah, that's painful. That's cold, huh? It's so cold. Yeah. Alright, we'll probably put our shoes back on and get going. So we're making our way up Trail Rider Pass still. And we've gotten to this junction right here. Sorry we haven't been really showing you guys the, the signs and the, the junctions, junctions. But you can see Geneva Lake will be to the left. Trail Rider Pass will continue right up this way. But there's a nice stream right here so we're going to refill our hydration packs before we keep on going. We're making it towards the end of Trail Rider Pass. That was it right in front of us. You could see Ala kind of walking by with it in the background. We're basically just gonna kind of wind down here and up that, or sorry, up that path to the top. But it's kind of getting warm, so the pants have been converted. The shorts are on, the legs are loose. But uh, also just a quick update, this might be a little bit of a longer one, but as we were walking up the bottom of Trail Rider Pass, we did come in, in contact with a mama bear and two cubs. They were maybe 100, 150 feet above the trail as we were switchbacking up. And as we started to get towards them and when we saw them, mama bear saw us see her. She perked up and gave us death stares. <laughs> So we backed off, walked the switch back down, and waited for about half an hour. And every few minutes, she would just pop up and give us another death stare. At one point earlier, she gave us a little growl and took us a couple steps closer. So that was another sign for us to back off. We decided after about half an hour, she had her and the cubs had gone enough away from the switchbacks to where we were able to safely detour just under the ridge and around them without coming in contact with them again. So just a reminder, wildlife is out there. 
stay safe. We have bear spray with us. Thankfully, we didn't need it. Um, but this view is gorgeous. There are the maroon bells right over there from a different viewpoint. Some massive peaks on the other side. And we'll make our way back up Trail Rider Pass, or make our way up it. Probably check in at the top. We just made it up to Trail Rider Pass. I'm absolutely beat. Dylan did pretty good. He actually took my, uh, he took the tent that was on my um, bag a little bit ago. But it is super windy up here. We're kind of hiding behind this little ridge right here. But I'll take you guys over here. We were actually talking to some people that were sitting right here. Um, and they were coming up this way and they said that they thought there was a waterfall over here. Just because just because of the wind. So it is pretty windy. We just came up from down there. And then we're going to be going down to Snowmass Lake. Which is just, just down there. We'll be camping down there. And you also got a nice view of some of the bells. Off in the distance back there. Don, do you have anything to add? Oh, that was pretty good. I mean, I'm guessing we're not going to check in on the way down. You can pretty much see the entire trail till we get to the lake. So yeah, maybe we'll right check now. in at the campsite or down by the lake. All right, guys, we'll check in later. We made it to the campsite here at Snowmass Lake. Here's our tent that we just set up. Alec going for a quick nap. <laughs> 30 minutes, Dylan. Wake me up in 30 minutes. 30 minutes. He says 30 minutes. I'm going to hold him to it. <laughs> but anyways, it's in a really cool spot. I'll show you kind of the scenery. We're right on Snowmass Lake. So I'll bring it down there. And this is it. Snowmass Lake. Today we came down from Trail Rider Pass, just up there. Came all the way down here to the lake. And it's pretty nice. There's a little island out there that you can't really see. We might walk over there and try to go for a swim. But we'll definitely go for a swim later. But that's the spot. All right, it's getting kind of warm out. We've been out here for a couple days now, so I'm gonna go for a swim in the lake. for it. Oh yeah. It's so nice. It's cold but it's like... Is it refreshing? Yeah. How was it? How was it? It's so nice. It's cold. But it looks like it's pretty shallow, pretty far out. Uh, yeah, you can walk through good waves. Yeah. It's steeper on the other side. Is it? We're kind of ending the night here. Um, it's currently seven o'clock. We got our dinner starting to cook today. We're going with chicken teriyaki. Should be good. Uh, and then we got the lake just down there. I don't know if you can see. It's just past those trees on that side. Nice campsite. Dylan, you have anything to say? Well, it's been another pretty good day. Tomorrow yeah, we're going to be finishing and uh, going back home. <laughs>